Hello, gentlemen. I really appreciate y'all's comments on that last video I made with the Blackstone Grill on the pork fried rice. And this is actually to Jason, 2024JZ. Uh, you made a comment about me being Hop Singh, and that really struck a nerve with me, and I'm going to show you why right here. Check this out. No, I don't have someone's head in this box. Wouldn't mind putting Bin Laden's head in there, though. See that pot? Okay, there's the pot. Now check this out. See in that? Hop. Sing. Now I had that made in 2003 for my dad from Mako Ovens. It's all custom made. Check this pot out. Now that's a pot. Okay, gentlemen. This is my Dutch oven. It's made by Mako. I had it custom made. Holds a chicken, you know, potatoes, everything else. Now, if you're doing any rough camping, Dutch oven is the only way to go. Uh, deal is put charcoal underneath, charcoal on top, and it cooks whatever's inside it. The other deal is put charcoal under the lid, you flip it over, and you got a griddle. You can cook your bacon and eggs or steaks right there. Can't go wrong. I like to have mine bubbling in grease with some cracklings in it or some frioles. Uh, some beans, yeah, it works. And since Jason, since you reminded me of this, and then since I dug it out of the bowels of the garage, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, use it a couple of times, make a couple of videos. I'm not sure what I'm gonna make in it yet, but we'll figure something out. I'm sure. It'll be part of my cardio diet. <laughs> anyway, thanks for that uh, comment, and just wanted to show you that. Thought it was kind of funny you calling me Hop Singh, and I got a pot with Hop Singh on it. Because that's what I used to call my dad because he was, you know, the camp cook. So, there you go.